Look at this, this baby's out. My lovely popsicle, y'all, I love this popsicle. Good morning, Prego fam. How you doing Friday night? Afternoon. It's like 3 o'clock. Almost 3 o'clock. Have a dance in your head and think you're dancing what you think you're dancing, but your body's not moving according to you. doing i had a doctor's appointment today i did not record myself in the doctor's office i wish i did but i didn't it went by so fast um they checked my my blood pressure it was good baby's heartbeat was 137 i believe and then the doctor checked me to see if i was dilated and guess what pregnant fam guess what y'all i am two and a half centimeters dilated at 30 not even 39 yet, but it's Monday, so I was going to do an update of a 39. Y'all, I am two centimeters, and he's in making his way out. The doctor could feel uh, him, his head being so low. He's right there in my pelvis. That's why it hurts so bad. I couldn't sleep that I mean, I slept at night but it was like every move that I made every it felt like I was grinding my like grinding on um, was so uncomfortable but with it being that uncomfortable it's so exciting because he's on his way out I am so excited I'm like I didn't see I know this is really gross I didn't see my mucus plug so I'm like I asked her I'm like she's like it could have come out it could still be in there and she doesn't know she she doesn't know but 
She said he's on his way out. I have another doctor's appointment on Monday. If he's not out by then, I am hoping that he's out by then. <laughs> so that way I don't have to go to that doctor's appointment. And if I do, it'll be more like for him and not for me per se. I'm so excited, y'all. My baby's on his way out. 39, he's coming. But she's, she didn't want to give me an exact time frame, an exact date of him between now and four centimeters when he'll be out. Starting to where we have to go to the hospital. So I have two more centimeters to go. And then we are heading to the hospital. I'm not sure if it's going to be today, tomorrow, next week. I don't know. We'll see. I don't think it'll be next week. I don't think. Because last week when I was there on Monday, I was still closed. I, had, I wasn't dilated one bit. The doctor, you know, it's only like he's not even making his way out at all. The fact one week later, here I am, two centimeters. Ah, your girls. I'm so excited. My baby's coming out. I get to meet him. I gotta pack my bag, my husband's bag. I get to put his clothes and my clothes in one bag. Make it a lot easier. I gotta wash the blanket. So I'm gonna wash that tomorrow. And I pranked my husband yesterday that my water broke. I, I'll show you guys that video. I'll post that video later. Um, probably tomorrow. It was hilarious. He didn't understand what was happening at first. Like he just kept running back and forth. Let me show you guys. It was so funny. See that car seat over there? <laughs> he was pacing back and forth he put the car seat in the front over there and I was like babe I thought I'd take a shower my water broke and y'all the car seat is already in the front ready to go I feel like I'm ready for this baby to get here I had a can of pineapple today I'm not sure if that helped at all if not um but He's making his way out, y'all. I'm so nervous. I'm so scared. We having. T I'm having uh, hot dogs today. I know someone's gonna be like, y'all, hot dogs are processed food. Don't worry. I got myself a vegan hot dog, so I can have some hot dogs. I'm craving some good old hot dog, y'all. We're gonna have that with some chips and salsa. I'll probably have some Tums because I it's just gonna, not going to work well with my stomach. And I'm so excited. We're going with to, to Patelis. You guys will see that in the video. We had, I had french fries and and chicken nuggets. I wish I showed you guys my, my food, but I didn't. It was really good. My mother-in-law went to lunch. Um, it was delicious. I am back home. I'm excited. I'm trying to lift things, move things. We gotta put the baby's bed together today. I was thinking of washing that mattress of his. Have it ready, we'll see. We'll see. Um, I'm so excited also, cause we get a new dryer tomorrow. I'll show you guys when they come over and, and install that. Well, they don't really install it for us. We got it at Best Buy. It was a pretty good deal. So, I should have recorded that, but I didn't. Oh well. <laughs> um, what else? I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. How long? Today is Monday, the 21st. So, October the 21st. Monday. We'll see how long it takes for him to come out. I want to say three days, but we'll see. I want to say three days, but we'll see. We'll see how long it takes for him to go from for me to go from two centimeters to four centimeters. I feel like I'm not sure, but I feel like either because she moved, touched something, I either I'm sweating or my water's dripping. I'm not sure. We'll see. 
I don't want to say that because <laughs> I don't want to say that. She was like, ooh, two, ooh, one and a half, two, three, two and a half. Like, I'm so excited though because I get to meet my son. I get to meet you, Langston. I'm so excited. Mommy is so excited to meet you. I'm so excited to be a mommy. I'm so excited to start this journey. And, but we'll see how, <laughs> once the process starts, we'll see how I am with the pain. We'll see how I am, how well I'm handling the contractions. Hopefully I don't curse nobody out. If I do, I'm apologizing right this second. So sorry. Be on it. Forgive me. But here we go. The journey has begun. I feel like this is like the best my favorite time right here. I'm gonna enjoy myself. I got some french fries and chicken tenders. I got some really awesome news I gotta tell you guys later. But I mean, trying to solve that the talus. We going down. Nom, nom, nom. Some break, some lunch. <sighs> I will talk to you guys later. Let's see if I can capture some more. What's your 